Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to connect Printify to WordPress in 2023. Of course, integrating Printify with your WordPress websites can enable you to offer a wide range of customized print on demand products to your customers. This comprehensive guide will walk you through the step by step process to seamlessly connect Printify to your WordPress site, allowing you to expand your product's offering and cater your audience's unique preferences. So, make sure to stick by. Let's dive right into this video and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. First, we'll have to go and set up our WordPress website. Of course, to do so, go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser and of course, in your case, you can use any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, make sure to go to this URL section and simply type WordPress sorry, wordpress.com and hit the enter button. Once you do so, of course, you'll have to uh, just access your dashboard, which is going to be the local host and etc. But of course, if you don't have an account on WordPress, you can simply go and log in into your account. Or sorry, if you have an account, you'll have to log in into your account. But if you don't have an account, you'll have to go and create an account. You'll be able to do so with your Google account if you don't want to get through all the boring steps of creating or even logging into your account. Make sure to even sign up for Printify if you don't have one. Go and open a new tab, go to printify.com and hit the enter button. And again, if you have an account, just log in into it. But if you don't, you'll have to go and create an account. Of course, if you're interested to see the price in here, we have even a free plan if you want to with those features. You can pause the video and check for the yearly plan and the monthly plan. For me, I'm just going to log in into my store, click on my store here, and I'll have it right there. For us, what we'll have to do now is simply add products to our Printify. For me, as you can see, I have one. One is not enough, so make sure to add products or you can like simply for you browse some products here and add your uh, design to it. So as an example, you can do so by going to my products here or even catalog, whatever you want. And simply as you can see, you'll find here all the products that you have. You can even, as an example, create some older orders here if you want to. Or if you go here to catalog, as an example, go to men clothing, as an example, go to t-shirts. As an example, let's just use this to add a product to one of my products here. So let's just go and choose, uh, let's see, this is cheaper. Uh, okay, let's go. just go with this. It has a lot of colors, a lot of sizes and etc. So let's just go here and click on start designing. And here, what we'll have to do, I'm just going to add a picture of my PC. Let's just add this plain picture as an example. And here you are. Let's just make it bigger, of course. Make it bigger a bit more. Of course, as you can see, it may not appear well. So let's just make it smaller a bit. So it will all appear where we want. And yeah, like that. So now, of course, as you can see, it's lower resolution. You can simply click on it. As you can see, it will automatically enhance low quality images for the best results possible. However, print uh, make quality or print quality may be affected. Because as you saw before, when it was small, it was bad quality. But as you can see, they fix it manually. So you don't have to do anything, basically. So here you can even change the colors. Example, so it's white. You can change the colors. Example, let's just do this color. Or let's just do a good color. Like this one, maybe. Or this one. Let's just go with this one. Why not? So you can select a lot of colors depending on whatever you want to add on your t-shirt so example let's just add a uh, yellow color uh, i don't know more red i don't know what color is this so there's a lot of colors here let's just select all of this then of course you can even add more designs not just one and simply go we can make it smaller or bigger to see it and you can preview it from here like as an example just preview it from front back you can preview it from person example just preview, preview it from that person you can even like add uh, the mock-up background if you want to. So, as an example, that's how it's going to look. And simply save the products. So as you can see from here, you can simply select like the title image. Uh, so people what's going to see when they're trying to purchase the products. So as an example, this or this or let's see something like this as an example. And you can add the title or change the title and even change the description if you want to you can add even size table if you want to imperial or matrix depending on whatever you want the pricing of course you can select whatever you want here depending on whatever you want and simply you can connect the store if you don't if you have it if you don't you can save it simply as a draft at the moment save it as a draft if you go to your products you'll find all the products that you have here so now what we'll have to do simply connect Printify to wordpress there's two options to do so 
the option for, uh, integrating from Printify and the option integrating from WordPress. If you want to start integrating from Printify, go to this list panel. As example, as example here, you'll find like a store settings. So click on that. Once you do so, go to Printify Connect, and as you can see, available with Printify Premium. You'll not be able to connect your Printify with anything unless you have Printify Premium if you want to start integration from uh, Printify. And of course, you can learn more, and you'll see what you'll have to pay if you want to get the premium. That's what you'll have to pay if you want to pay monthly. If you want to pay yearly, you'll have to pay just simply this with those features. As you can see, we said that for uh, connecting a uh, Printify with WordPress, if you want to start the uh, integration from Printify, if you want to start it from WordPress, you can go to your dashboard, go to plugins, go to add new, and simply once you do so, go here to search plugins and look for Printify. Hit the enter button, and let's see if they have a plugin for it. As you can see, they have a plugin for it, so you don't have to do anything. Simply click on it, and as you can see, make sure to read this requirements. So make sure as you can see to have a 3.8 or higher version of wordpress and compatible as you can see with this active installation is one uh, or ten thousand or more so here you'll find description and uh, like features here you'll find installation process here are the screenshots on how it's going to look and finally here you'll find the reviews of other people as you can see there's a kind of 15 uh, one star a lot of people who uh, vote one star they don't meet or they don't like see this requirement requirement and they don't do it Thor is Printify, so you don't have to do anything. Of course, if you want to try it first, it's going to be good. If you don't, you can simply go and install it right now. After it's installed, you can activate it right away. So it's installed, click on activate, and it will be activated. So as you can see, you'll have to scroll down now and look for this, as you can see, Printify shipping method. As you can see, make sure to enable auto updates. So if there's any updates, it should be updated. And simply connect your Printify with your WordPress without any problems. Once you do so, you'll be able to uh, import your products from Printify to WordPress, and you can manage your orders and performance, add your, uh, maybe address the customer's queries and, and returns, and make sure to stay informed about any updates or changes from both Printify and WordPress. You can keep and make sure to even keep your products less and accurate and up to date to provide a seamless shopping experience. And that's going to be it. So if you reached this point of this video, congratulations. Integrating Printify with the WordPress website in 2023 can open doors for your new growth opportunities for your new online sale, uh, business. By offering customizable uh, or custom customizable uh, print-on-demand products, you can provide your customers with unique items uh, that resonate with them. This integration simplifies the process of creating, listing, and fulfillment these products, enabling you to focus on delivery's exceptional customer experience and with Printify, uh, efficient print-on-demand service and versatile WordPress platform, you can expand your product's range, attract a broad customer base, and drive sales. So if you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below, subscribe for our channel for more helpful stories like this one. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.